to pass profit challenges yes guys i know you've been failing you've been inconsistent and a lot has been happening in your profit mode but then today i'm here to assist you so in today's video i'm going to be talking about an aggressive way to approach pro firms and also a slow but effective way to approach pro firms and i also have a gift in the middle of the video so without any further ado guys let's get into the video first of all guys i want to talk about the aggressive way to approach pro firms so how do you go about this strategy you give yourself four percent buffer trades what do i mean by four percent buffer trades um you get an initial account of 10k usd right and you're going to give yourself 400 dollars like money to gamble with initial with the initial given with the initial balance guys yes you're going to be taking four percent out of that um initial account let's say 400 dollars and trade try to finish the account in those four trades right um you're going to be risking full one percent on four trades so that it means you're giving yourself four trades and if it happens you go down minus four percent right you then decrease the risk by 0.5 percent let's say you lost four trades in a row why do you do that you do that so that you can add yourself more odds add yourself more trades because if let's say you are trading a challenge and the maximum drawdown is eight percent let's say now you are down four percent you're gonna be left with another four percent to play with but then those are now small trades because if you have been losing four trades in a row which means there's a problem maybe let's say with your system or you're on a losing streak so in order to give yourself more odds to pass the challenge you need to divide the rest of the risk by two which means you're going to be left with how many trades you're going to be left with eight trades again so guys with this aggressive approach it is for you to finish the challenge not to keep it and busy trading it for the longest period of time like what others do when they are risking 0.5 percent because risking 0.5 percent is a bit slow right and you might find yourself trading a challenge for the whole of the year still not passing because the point of this challenge is for you to pass and make money not for you to be trading and keeping them for the longest of time right but then at the same time being aggressive doesn't mean you have to be reckless right because you know me i follow the game plan very well right in as much as we're aggressive but then we're not trying to blow the challenges right so let's say now it happens you lose four you're going to be late with four percent divide by four percent by two so you're going to be risking 0 0.5 now that is more eight trades again so it is like much more like impossible for you to be playing that challenge i believe if you are trading problem challenges you have to be ready right you need to be ready and you cannot tell me you can lose a bunch of all of those trades you are losing four trades plus eight that is um how much 12 right you've lost 12 trades in a row which means there's a problem and you need to be you need to fix something on your plan right and then let's say now let's talk on the big side of it you are risking four percent or maybe let's say in a trade as for me um i usually look for a one is two five in each position i take right so in each winning position let's say i take that first trade i i get a one is two five already now i'm up five percent you know what i'm saying so now up five and imagine i gave myself a buffer trade of four now plus five i have a buffer trade of nine i now have nine percent to be playing around right and then maybe the next two trades i lose I go five minus two, that is up three. Now I'm up three percent. Maybe the third trade that I get, I get another one is to five. Now I'm done. Target hit. Say the target was eight. Now the target is hit. Like with just three trades. Now you can now trade on your, your real accounts, especially when you are trading the one step. So this is the aggressive way. So the aggressive way is buy yourself a one step challenge, right? Buy yourself a one step and then use this strategy you can also apply this strategy in the two step but then it is going to take you a bit longer yet but still it's the same thing just that you have a target of a profit target of around how many 15 percent usually the two step challenges are 15 percent and then the one step is usually um eight tips guys when using this aggressive strategy um you need to be patient right you need to be very patient because here we, we are going to only apply high probability setup so we mean high quality like the nicest of trades you know picture perfect trades because why here we're being aggressive there's a higher chance you can lose the challenge right not that you can lose the, the, the chance is much more higher because we are using much more aggressive approach right you need to trade a great setups only and it's gonna take you a while finding those setups but in each setup you get you know you have a higher chance of winning because you are patient to the high quality setup when it appears it's gonna play out and in return you are going to have a high strike rate right so majority of your trades will win 
which means your psychology won't be messed up with and another thing i have to add on is the psychology part your psychology has to be very good when you are trading on um, the aggressive method like the aggressive needs someone who is already consistent or someone who is seeing consistency right you can now use the aggressive method yeah, well, because you need a level of psychology that is going to give you patience and look for high quality setups you need to be cool calm and collected and composed you know you don't need to be euphoric when you're winning and you don't need to look down yourself when you're losing you just, you just need to be on a flow state when you're being aggressive because now you are trading to finish and you want to be like you want to make money right so yeah that is it for the aggressive method now for the slow and effective and recommended for most of your methods Sorry to disrupt you, Vin, guys. I have this good news for you guys. So I've partnered with Top One Trader, the best pro firm around here. Why do I say that? This pro firm offers extra 25% capital on all of the challenge when you buy a challenge. You know what I'm saying? So what do I mean by that? Let's say you are buying a 10K challenge. You get an extra 25% capital to trade with. And they're also running a 35% um, discount on all of the challenges as you can see this one was 125 and you can get it for 81 us dollars including the 25 percent capital so what you need to do is when you are purchasing this one you're gonna click here and then there's the code there what you do is you fill up your details and then the coupon code you're gonna write there as you can see here it is it is even below there like july july 35 right and then you apply the code and then your discount is already applied okay coupon already applied and then your discount is going to be there as you can see minus 43 us dollars and that is a lot you know what i'm saying so that is a lot so let's go back so i need to show you something right so here are the challenges that they offer and they offer capital of up to 200 000 us dollars and on this one as I said, you get 25% extra capital to trade it, which means if you are buying a 200k, you will be trading a 250k from the get-go, right? So this is the one-step challenge. What do we mean by that? It is only one step, you know? Like there's no two phase, just one phase. And here are the rules right here. And then let's go to the two step guys. It's the same as all, same as the one step challenge. However, this one is just two steps, the first phase and the second phase. You can choose on which challenge to buy, either the first step challenge or the second step challenge, right? And it's a beautiful website and it is legitimate. I also have gotten a payout from this company guys so i wouldn't be promoting a company that i haven't got a payout from right so right now i just want to show you how the dashboard is so i also got another challenge from them the one step flash challenge all right so with this challenge guys i want to show you how the dashboard is okay so this is going to be the accounts overview right and you can press your matrices there and then it can show you how your challenge is going right so here i was just testing out a trade here the matrices right there so beautiful display of everything you can check your state six sticks over there and you can also check your order history um your trade journaling is gonna be there everything is just clear like that and yeah this is the only pair that i took there so yeah what i like about this dashboard is guys the rules section why do i like this section you have all of your rules written here on the dashboard you don't need to go to the website again to check this rules you just have the rules here you can like read them every day you wake up just in case just in case guys so you cannot make mistakes and uh bridge the account so with that said guys i'm also having a giveaway i will be giving away two one step flash challenges to any of um my subscribers so what do you need to do you need, just need to subscribe to the channel and then follow me on instagram and then you'll find further instructions on instagram guys i'm gonna be posting the instructions there so you just need to be a subscriber and then follow me on instagram and then you will check the instruction pinned on my instagram page that will be the first pin there you'll find there and then you do the instruction with that said guys let's get back to the video
Okay guys, now for the slow approach. So on the slow approach, you can never blow a prop frame challenge using this slow approach guys. You can never. And I am an example of that because that is the method that I used um, the first time I started trading prop firms and I've been having like my prop firm for like uh, more than a year now. Not blowing, not anything, just consistent using this method. So what does this method consist of? You just need to have a buffer of 2%, right? 2% buffer now not four percent but two percent buffer but this time around you do not just um risk two percent no you have to create the buffer of two percent by what using 0.5 percent right so you're going to be trading 0.5 percent until it reaches you how much plus two percent on the challenge when you are up two percent now it is then that you're going to be risking how much full one percent so now you're going to have a buffer of how many trades of two one percent trades and in those two one percent trades um you have to be choosing the best trades right and hoping on those two trades you are going to get maybe one one is to five trade and then you, you can continue your buff of risking full one but it ha if it happens maybe let's say you lose your first trade on trying to make the buffer now you are going to be using still the 0 0.5 because let's say your challenge now that you have bought it is a, it is a maximum drawdown of 10 percent right if you are risking 0 0.5 from the get-go that means you have 20 trades to play with right you have 20 trades because you are risking a 0 0.5 okay but then it is low because if you go to draw down like draw down draw down draw down it might take you a while to get back up to the two percent but look at the catch still you have been like down using what 0 0.5 so it's still the same thing but then this one is for people who are still trying to figure out their system right you want to test your system now in the live market conditions you do not afford challenges that much these problem challenges but you really want to keep this one so i'd advise you use the 0 0.5 method whereby initially you are risking 0 0.5 until you have a buff of two percent once you're up to now you allow yourself to be risking two one percent trades until you finish the challenge if it happens you go down back to back even you continue again risking you go back to risking what 0 0.5 percent right zero point until you get the buffer of two what we are going to be playing with here is just the buffer of two right because if you are still struggling with your trading you're gonna need to be risking 0 0.5 because let's say you're gonna be taking a trade that is low risk and you didn't know you are still finding out your system right but then you need like at least a live condition to be working with okay so if you have a live condition to be working with it's, it becomes better right and then everything comes to plan and with the system guys as you can see if you have 20 trades to be playing with you can never lose guys if you are losing 20 trades in a row it means there's a problem you need to go back to the drawing board but then if you are testing your system now you can start with this second method but then as i said guys the first method is the best if you want to just finish these things because yeah we have to be fast we have to make money and if you need a challenge guys as i said the link is going to be below and this month there's huge discounts huge discounts i explained in the adverts right so yeah and also guys if you need mentorship i'm also available you can dm me on whatsapp i'm just gonna pop my number if you need forex coaching i also do provide forex coaching and then for those who want to join our free discord server because in my previous videos if you can watch them i've been explaining that i have a discord server whereby i post daily analysis and videos to helping people who just want to fix their skill a bit and who don't have the money to pay for mentorships but then that is not mentorship it is just there for me to be sending the setups to be sending videos and helping you in a few things right but then if you just need serious help you've been trading for four years or how many years you are still not getting it I can be the right person to coach you and i can help you reach the consistency level you need with that said you can watch my previous videos guys for technical analysis i've been elaborating on major important stuff about falcon if you are looking for high probability setup to trade using the falcon method you can watch this previous video and it can get you closer to what with the aggressive approach so guys can you please subscribe to the channel also like and turn the notification bell for more content like this as always i'm going to see you on my next video